what's up guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna do my everyday glam makeup look it's not what i do all the time but it's definitely when i know i'm gonna be taking pictures i know i want to look very presentable basically you know but yeah it's a sim super simple look um if you want to know how i recreated this look then just keep watching I'm priming my eyes with this concealer from Maybelline. It is called the Instant Age Rewind and it looks like this. I blend it out with my beauty blender after. Now I'm going to set my eyelids with this Tartlet Free Spirit. It's just this plain old white one to set the concealer and all that. This is going to be a simple look you guys. This is like my everyday makeup look you could say. Um, it's gonna be pretty pretty simple so if you were looking for, for something dramatic it's not this video today and then I'm gonna go in with one right here with this fluffy Sigma brush this one is E40 and I'm just gonna put that on my crease just to add some definition back now I'm just going to add some mascara and I'm going to use two of them and I'm going to use the Benefit Their Real and the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black. Oh, you know. That's what I get for talking. I'm going to use my MAC foundation, the Pro Longwear in NC20 and I just put it on my brush, the brush I was raving about last time to you guys and just put it everywhere and I'll spray my face with the Mario Badescu I have dry skin okay and I'll start blending it with this and I'm gonna go after with the beauty blender and then for my under eyes I'm gonna use this benefit boing number two and it is this I have really bad circles as you guys can see um, and sometimes I feel like concealer alone doesn't cover them so I just use like the pink to cancel it out like already you can see a difference you know everybody has their different opinions or views on an everyday makeup so yours can literally be mascara and eyebrows like this is more like a healthy like glowy everyday makeup you know like it's pretty kind of glam type of look like picture ready you know yeah if you think this is too much sorry we're not on the same boat <laughs> but okay after i'm done with that i've been obsessed with this mac pro long pro long wear concealer and nw20 i uh, this was like my first high-end concealer and then to set my face i'm going to use the maybelline fit me matte and poreless and this one's in natural beige i forgot i had this powder but guys it is so good um it is like really good like it leaves your skin flawless true match it's super blendable powder in w8 i believe it was on clarence so i bought it but i'm obsessed with it and I already hit pants, so I'm gonna have to buy a new one. And we're just gonna bronze our face like we're not really defining it or anything. Um, I'm not contouring. For blush, I'm gonna use this NYX blush in Dusty Rose. And it's kind of like a mauve color. It's so cute. And I'm using this Allure brush. And I'm just adding a little bit of color. I wasn't going to bake my face but I'm going to anyways just because and this isn't the Laura Mercier powder it's my air spun powder it was like this is how much I I hope it's my air spun powder this is how much I had I literally had a little bit of my air spun so it was just like let me just use this empty Laura Mercier powder thingy to put my stuff in there I'm gonna put some under underneath my eye just to be extra. I don't do this every day, guys. Don't do this every day. Then for highlight, I'm gonna use these two. And this is, again, the Wet n Wild from a Fergie collection in Rose Champagne. And then the Tarte Exposed Highlight. Yeah, it honestly just makes your skin look more glowy. Like, look how healthy my skin looks, guys. Beautiful. No 
For the bottom lash line, I just go in with some bronzer. This one's the Hula one. Let me see. Get a little small brush and just go run it down on my bottom lash line. This, and then for our highlight, again, I'm going to use both of these and mix them together. This will open up your eyes, like, super good. And just connect it on the right here because you don't want to have like highlight right here and then it stops right there you know so just connect it especially if you do the c form thing okay these are the coco lashes my please bring you got it for me but i'm not used to how thick they are but now i'm just gonna water my eyes with the next wonder pencil and medium and it's just so it opens up my eye it's the next tinted brow pencil look so i'm just gonna feather them out and i do it upwards this like gives you enough color and makes your brows look super full now for lips last but not least i'm going to use these two colors and they're from mac i'm going to use velvet teddy and it's in that since it's like an everyday look like i said i don't want to use lip liner like it's not necessary I have look how pretty that is guys and then i'm going to mix it with satin and it's sis this is more of like a skin color and then last spray. I literally drown myself. This is my final look. But this is more of my glam type of thing. Yeah, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. And make sure you hit that notification bell down below. So you get notified every time I upload. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.